Hey there everybody, how's it going? Welcome back to another episode of the KSP Let's Play. And for today's episode, well it's not going to be a long one, unfortunately I don't have a lot of time to record. So I did just want to get a little something quick out for you guys again. That's the uh, one of the crappy parts with the KSP, doing a proper episode and getting a lot of material together just takes so freaking long. Uh, when you've only got like 20-30 minutes to record, there's not a whole lot you can do. So anyhow, we're just going to be doing a couple of quick things here. Uh, I don't know if you guys remember this, I played around with it a couple of episodes ago and promptly crashed it into the ground. I did sort of figure out what's wrong with it, but not really. I, I can't... I mean, I, I, I assume it flies now. I haven't been able to get it up into the air since then because it just refuses to take off. I don't know what happens on the on the runway, it just flips on its side like a big jerk. But I did figure out a way to even things out a little bit. I was complaining before that I couldn't do symmetry for these two wings because, well, there's nothing to do symmetry on. You, you've got these two other tanks in the way, so if it tries to do a symmetry, for example, let me show you here, it would try to do it on the inside of that tank as opposed to on the other side. So I did figure out actually a pretty neat way of uh, dealing with that. So it involves kind of cheating a little bit like so. So you make sure you have the double setup going. And then what I did want to change here is actually this wheel. Just do that up real quick. Like so. Alright, perfect. So now we have that. Let us put this baby back where she belongs. Just want to make sure everything's all nice and, uh, you know, where it's supposed to be and all that fun stuff. Come on, guy, what do you, uh, there we go. That is, something's throwing me off. Yeah, it's just the other side. Okay, I'll fix it up afterwards. Just leave it like that. Alright, so yeah, now we clearly have this extra thing here that we don't need. That was actually my mistake. I didn't even need to do that. An unnecessary step. Go back to single mode. There we go. That's what was messing me up. Okay, so we'll leave it there, I guess. Sure, why not? And then get rid of... Dang it. <laughs> sure, get rid of that, because I guess we don't need that. And then get rid of that. So now how we do it is we go back up here, and bam, we got that. So now you basically just take this other one, there you go, you got that one, single it up, and you have it in there. I actually did that wrong because I should have just copied the other thing. So you end up doing it like so to get the other side, and mess it up again because you forget to press copy, or the symmetry. All right, there we go. And now we have two identical wings on each side. Neat, huh? Now all you gotta do is just align these up here, just the, the two wings. And I'm just using these, like the little edge there to align the wings. I don't know, that's probably not the best way to do it, but it's the way I'm doing it. I'm actually gonna move it over just a little bit forward. All right, so it's there. Let's see, it's aligned. Like, uh... Sure, right there, why not? Now this is the only problem with this. Unfortunately you can't you can't get it quite right because you can't quite see what you're doing. But I actually think that's that looks pretty good to me. Oh no, not quite. It's just underneath the like line here. The edge of the thing is underneath the line. Oh my god, this is gonna be a pain. Let's get a good angle there. Alright, so it should be like... So. Right? Nope, that's that's like angled downwards. Now I can't see a damn thing in here. So much easier when I can just align it with like the edge. Holy, this is, this is frustrating. That's... Should be like right there, I think. Yep, right underneath, and not quite. Not quite. Needs to be moved over just a tad more. Oh my god, brutal! 
I hate I hate planes. I absolutely despise. I love you know planes in real life and flying them in flight simulators and stuff. But in this game, oh my god, do I ever hate planes? Just building them, flying them, everything. Is that right? No, I messed it up again. God damn it! <laughs> it's supposed to be a bit more this way, and there. Is that good? Are we good? We are not good. Okay, okay, so it looks like it's aligned with the little... See how there's two circles there? Okay, I can't even point with the mouse when I have this thing. Looks like it's aligned more with that smaller inside circle. Is that good? I can't even... Okay, you know what, forget it. It's fine, it'll, it'll do. It's probably not gonna do anything because this thing is a piece of butts. Yes, that's right. It's a piece of butts. Multiple butts, of which it is only one piece of. I don't know why. I, I got it to go down the runway in a straight line, but then at one point when it hits around like 80 or uh, 90 meters per second, it just flips on its side. I'm like, nope, I don't, I don't want to go up. I want to go on my side. So we'll see if that happens again. <laughs> oh, I am... Yeah, this, this plane has caused me nothing but trouble. That's not gonna work because I forgot the struts. Dang it. I have to go back. You know what? Let's try. Let's see what happens without the struts. It's probably not going to do too well. And yes, I'm also angling these legs out or the, the landing gears out a little bit more just because I think it helps with the balancing or to keep it straight when it's on the runway. Yeah, it's definitely. Uh, yep, yep. <laughs> We need struts. We need struts to keep things together. Keep them from wobbly. Getting all wobbly when you're trying to take off. Oh, I wanted to get the SSTO going this time too, because I did actually fix it up a little bit. And I wanted to show you guys the progress on that. Pretty sure I can get that thing up into orbit. I did a couple of tests and I got really close. So yes, maybe we'll do a little bit of that. I totally forgot to start keeping track of time, so hopefully we're <laughs> we're doing okay on time. All right, let's try this again. If this doesn't work, which chances are it won't, we're just gonna jump into the SSTO a little bit and get a little bit of flying done. I really don't know how long I've gone on for. I hope it's not too long. Probably hasn't been, maybe like five minutes or so. I need a better way of keeping keeping track of time. All I've got is just like a stopwatch. It's such a getaway of doing it. I just need something to, you know, do the job a little better than my crappy phone stopwatch. And yes, I do have a crappy phone. I have a flip phone. That's right. Who do you know who still has a flip phone? Well, this guy. All right, so it's going in a straight line. That's good. We're speeding up. We're getting up there, and it's going to flip soon. As it tends to do. Maybe. It's not flipping. Okay. Let's speed up a little bit more then and get ready to take off. Oh my. There it is. There it is. There it is. Absolutely no reason for any of that to happen. As far as I'm aware, it just... <sighs> Friggity hell. Oh look, one of the uh, landing gear survived. And a canard. <laughs> Man. <sighs> All right. Well, you know what? I'm not. I'm not even gonna rescue that guy or revive him or whatever. I think that was Dun Dunman Dunwin. Whatever. Screw you, Dunman. You're useless. You and your terrible plane. Oh, I, I really need to figure out why that happens. It looks like everything's working out just fine, and then it doesn't. I think I, maybe I need two wheels in the front to keep things a little bit more stable? I don't know. Anyhow, let's jump into the... Is my game frozen? Nope, it's not. Uh, okay. I just... I'm just silly. Never mind. Let's... Uh, oh, this is perfect. Yep. Full stupidity, no courage. Sounds good to me. It's like... Uh, is that Bill or is that Bob? One of the two. I can't remember which one. One of the two is more courageous, but more stupid. Or less stupid, the other guy is just totally stupid and courageous. I think that's actually Jeb. I don't know what I'm talking about. Guys, I'm so freaking tired. <laughs> just, uh, I'm sorry if I'm babbling on today. It's just, 
yeah, things have not been too great lately in the real life. But anyhow, let's uh, let's show you what I did here. I don't know if you guys can uh, recognize most of that. I could swear I added more things here. I hmm. I definitely added more of these air intakes. But I guess they didn't save. I don't know. Whatever. Let's just go flying. Let's go fly over to the island. I want to try to land on the island this time. Yeah, well, I'm pretty sure we can go full throttle off the start with this. Because as far as I'm aware, it, it doesn't flip on its side like a jerk bag like the other plane does. I do love these engines. Just the way they look when they, when they fire up like that. It looks really cool. Yeah, so we're good, but we're not lifting. That's the, the one problem with this plane is uh, she doesn't lift until we get to the end of the runway. Oh, crap. Oh, I shouldn't have done that. Um, yeah, that's uh, that's par for the course in, uh, in this space program. Things explode often, yes. I don't know what happened there. I was trying to adjust the... Uh, the the path of it, it was kind of drifting off to the side a little bit, and uh, it decided that, you know, it's going to join its uh, its other brethren in deciding to flip on its side and kill everybody. Alright, let's try this again. Let's go, 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 go. I'm not even going to try adjusting, I'm just... You know what, I'm just going to start holding up. Just from right here, I'm just going to start trying to pitch up, and... Okay, maybe adjust it a little bit. Don't want to... Oh, crap, crap, crap. Too much adjustment. Fudge Packer. <laughs> oh, now I can't remember if this is the plane that I fixed or not. Because I know the plane that was actually working 100% before had more air intakes on it. This doesn't. So I... Oh, frig. All right, let's try that again. I guess this is this is exciting, isn't it? Just watching me just crash over and over again. All right, maybe we'll go a little slower off the the takeoff here. Put that SAS on as well. I don't know if that's gonna help too much. I actually don't know how much that does on the ground. I'm guessing it helps. I mean, it, it's always there to help you. So why are we going to the right? Stop! Stop! Okay, we're going to like give it a little tweak every now and then. Alright, now we need to start pulling up. Yeah, we need to. Yep. <laughs> yeah, she doesn't really pull up until you get to the end of the runway, but then she does, and it's all good. Oh, and I should probably throttle up. There we go, yeah. So I've gotten this thing up uh, pretty far, actually. It got up as high as like 20, 22 kilometers, roughly. So that was pretty awesome. And I think I got it the cruising speed up to around 1400 before I messed up and kind of flamed out and went into a dive and uh, killed. Uh, I thought it was Chris Kerman before. I guess we got Dilberry in there now. It's like Dilbert. But yeah, it's. Uh, I think it'll get up there. I think. I'm not too confident in that arrow spike actually because when I did get up to 1400 meters a second, I. Yeah, I started using the arrow spike and it wasn't working. But part of that was because I had, I was way too high up in the atmosphere and I had a ton of fuel for the actual turbo jets. Like I definitely could have used these a lot more, but I was dumb and had a bit too much of a steep incline or ascent. Yes, steep incline for my ascent. Anyhow, we're uh, we're flying. Yes, we are. I wish you could see a little bit better out of this cockpit. But now we're starting to go down, and I don't want that. So, yes, we'll start pulling up again. Should I try landing with cockpit view? That's, that is not a good idea. Don't even think about it. I'm sure I will at some point. I'll, I really want to do a lot more cockpit landings and uh, launches and whatnot. But, yeah, not, not yet. Anyway, let's... Uh, Let's try to get her a little bit more this way, so we can come around from the side and hopefully not crash into that little hill this time like we did last time. Now that we know it's there, we have no excuse. And it'll 
will probably happen anyways. But that's fine. That's okay. Alrighty, now we come back in this way. This is looking good. Or so I like to think anyways. It probably isn't, it probably looks terrible, but hey, I'm having fun. I hope you guys are having fun too. There we go. Start getting her a bit down. We slow down a little bit. Get those gears out. Are they called what are they called? Yeah, they are called gears. Whenever I say gears, I think of the landing legs, and whenever I say legs, I think of gears. I don't know, it's it's weird. I also don't know why this thing doesn't rotate properly. Okie dokie, here we go. We gotta go more this way. More this way. More this way. Yes, please. That is the way that you should be going. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Here we go. Slow down a little bit more. I don't know if that's too much. Are we aligned? We are... What are you doing? Why? It's, it's, it's got to be this delta wing. I'm blaming it on the delta wing. I don't know why it turns like this. Yeah, I'm totally blaming it on that delta wing. So when, when I try to rotate, I'm sure you notice, there's that weird spin every once in a while. Anyway, we're, we're coming in at a horrible angle. This is not going to go well. But it might. It just might. Oh, crap. Crap, 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 crap. Oh, 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 man. Yeah, I got really quiet there for a second, because, well, you know. And then I died. Ah, oh, balls. <laughs> well, anyhow, I'm going to be leaving it here for now, because I really have no idea how long I have been on time. What am I looking at here? It must be like a piece of something buried. Yeah, there's stuff buried in the uh, in the runway. But anyhow, yeah, I don't know how long I've been going on time, so I don't want to go too long, because I gotta head out soon. Anyhow, guys, I hope you enjoyed this wonderful episode of me crashing a whole bunch of times, as I tend to do pretty much every time I fly a plane. Alright, so on that note, I will catch you guys next time. You know, let me know what you thought down below, and... Yes, I screwed up my outro. Haha, -ha. so I will leave it with a simple goodbye.